Brian Scraper, fighting out of Trials Martial Arts in Fort Collins, Colorado. Uh, my prediction is a highly technical Muay Thai fight. Um, I want to thank Max Muscle, Northern Colorado, Title Boxing Club, Pivotal Wellness, Trials Martial Arts, ESP365.com, and Rain Tree Athletic Center. Hey, my name is Zach. I'm from Grudge Training Center. Uh, I see an action-packed fight coming your way, so don't get up to the popcorn. Stay there. It's knockouts coming your way. I'd like to thank Constantin Amiya and Enshin Karate, all the great trainers at Grudge Training Center, and all of my awesome training partners. And that's the reason I'm about to smash this dude. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the cage, fighting out of the Ugly Dog Red Corner. Give it up for Brian Superman Scraper. opponent making his way to the cage fighting out of the Spartan Labs blue corner. Give it up for Zach Wells.
This fight is sponsored by Moe's Original Barbecue. Locations in Bear Creek and Boulder. Moe's Original Barbecue serves up an award-winning barbecue experience. The referee for this bout will be Curtis, Th Curtis Thrasher. And now fighting out of the Ugly Dog Red Corner. This fighter is representing Trials MMA. Weighing in at 185.8 pounds. Fighting out of Fort Collins, Colorado. Give it up for Brian Superman Scraper. And his opponent fighting out of the Spartan Labs Blue Corner. This fighter is representing Grudge Training Center. Weighing in at 183.6 pounds. Fighting out of Denver, Colorado. Give it up for Zach Wells. Okay, gentlemen, you received your instructions early in the dressing room. Expect you to obey my commands at all times. Protect yourself at all times. Let's touch them up right now. Good luck. There's your instructions from referee Curtis Thrasher in this 185-pound professional Muay Thai fight. We have Zach Wells in the blue trunks representing world-famous Grudge Training Center facing off against the Trials MMA fighter, Mr. Brian Scraper in the white and green trunks. I always love watching Brian Scraper fight. And dropped with a right. Big shot right there by Wells, taking the eight count. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome, buddy. Keep that good pressure. That's why I'm Brian. here. Head moving. Brian with a very uh, Terminator-like walkthrough, <laughs> walk in. <laughs> Absolutely, and there's a beautiful a hard body, body kick. Shot. Whoa, followed by a nice teep. Brian Scraper has got to be one of the busiest fighters Pressure, on the Brian. circuit. <laughs> I mean, we see him fight every month almost. <laughs> Seems that way. Here in Pro Muay Thai, you are allowed to knee to the face. And after getting off to uh, a bit of a rocky start there, Scraper really starting to press the action. He wants that eight count back. Yeah, absolutely right. Both of these guys slugging from the get-go, my goodness. And Scraper really landing some hard body shots, but he's staggered again, and down he goes. That's a big right hand by Zach Wells. Wow. Good counter shot by Wells. There's a lot of power in that right hand. My goodness, that's twice. You think? A little bit. <laughs> a little bit. Wow. Am I stating the obvious? <laughs> Master of the blatantly. <laughs> and the corner of Wells saying, keep it calm, that just keep doing it. And that's it. That's going to be it. If there's three knockdowns in a round, fight's yeah. over. Below so the belt? No, I think that I think that he just caught him below the belt. Oh, okay. I did not see it as below the belt. I saw it on the belt line myself. Okay. Well, with that having been said, if there is another knockdown that goes for an eight count, <laughs> That's what the rules stipulate. Three knockdowns means the end of a round. Being proactive, are you? <laughs> but Scraper trying to walk it off here. Referee Curtis Thrasher giving him a moment. And you were saying that the last time we did one of these that somebody got one like that. You said that it hurts. Yeah. Yeah, getting, getting kicked in the pills is not a pleasant thing. Hmm. Imagine that. There's that big right hand again and the knee strike. That's going to be a knockdown. No eight count there. Just pushed him off his feet. Did Wells. Wells, one more time, gets that right hand in. He really does. And I got to say, for Scraper, I think head movement's going to be the key with Wells because he's really connecting with just about everything. Wells put up a nice head kick there. Scraper blocked a well, but still rocked him to the side a bit. And Scraper is not on steady feet. No, he's not. He's not. He's hurt. I think he's still hurt from that last knockdown, and that, that one looked good. That's it. That's it. Congratulations to the Grudge Training Center fighter. Zach Wells goes home with the victory in his pro MM or excuse me, his pro Muay Thai 185-pound debut. Let me tell you something. That was a display right there. Wow. Scraper is no joke, and he is hurt. He is visibly hurt.
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Thrasher has called a stop to this fight at two minutes and seven seconds of the first round due to a TKO, TKO for your winner, Zach Wells. I'm here with your winner, Zach Wells. Very impressive display. What was your game plan coming into the fight this afternoon? To kill him. Was there anything that took you by surprise or anything that threw you off your game plan at all? Uh, yeah, I, I was acting a little weird at the beginning. I don't know why. Who, who would you like to thank? Kancho Ninomiya and Ancient Karate. Trevor Whitman, Brian Youngs, Jake Ramos, Butch, all the great guys at uh, Grudge Training Center who are just make me who I am and my training partners who just sharpen me up every day. Os. Fantastic display, thanks. Your winner, Zach Wells, ladies and gentlemen.